Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Tyler with Tarver Academy. If you could please subscribe, that'd be super great. Okay, so I want to talk to you today about using your contacts. Um, these are, a contact is just like in your phone, it's someone that you frequent with regards to email um, in Google. Um, you know, there are Hangout contacts as well if you're talking about Google Hangouts, but we're going to talk primarily from just your general contacts. So the first thing people need to know is, is how to get there. In Gmail, used to, there was like a little thing that said mail right here that you can click on and get to your contacts. Now, if you go down here, you can see your Hangouts, contacts, all of them, uh, but we're not going to do that. I'm going to show you the other way to get to them. So hit the, I'm going to start a new tab. And then it's just like anything else in Google. Whatever you want to do, you type that in. So contacts.google.com. Now, it's going to bring up kind of like my control center for all of my contacts. So uh, instead of groups, it's, it looks like they're con calling them labels now. And so here are some of my frequent contacts. So I'm just going to select the boxes of all these people. And... Uh, what I want to do is I want to create a label. So I'll go up here to this little thing, just like the labels look like in Gmail. And you're doing it for an email. We're now doing it for context. So I'm going to create a label. I'm going to call it friends. Hit save. And now over here, it's created that group, friends, and has them in it. Now, what that does for me, so you're like, oh, okay, great. Why do I need to group my friends together? Well, now I'm going to hit refresh so that it can update all of that. I want to hit compose. Now, if I want to send an email to my friends, I just type in friends and look, it automatically pulls them up and it puts all their names in there. So it allows you to uh, essentially do what you're doing with groups, but now you can add, it's a lot easier to add people to multiple groups. So if you have like um, someone you work with, like a, a co-teacher and you want to add them to each of your class periods, you could easily add them on there to all those. So. Uh, that's it. That's Google Contacts, and that's the only thing that I have in the list for uh, Google Certified Leg Educator Level 1. If you could subscribe, that'd be great, and never stop learning. Bye, you guys. Hey, what's up? Thank you so much for watching my training video. If that helped at all, please subscribe to this channel. It's free. costs nothing. Just click the little red subscribe button unless they change the color. Hey, also, if you want me to come to your school and help train your teachers or your administrators or your students and help make your life easier with Google, just let me know. I've got links in the bio on how to get a hold of me. DM me at Tyler Tarver on Instagram or Twitter. You can go hit my email, tylertarver at gmail.com. Um, or you can just yell really loud. Maybe I'm close. Oh, I thought I heard somebody. What, you want me to come train us on Google? No, okay. It'll be fun. We'll learn a lot. And I'll give you a bunch of resources. So thank you guys. Hey, did you subscribe? We talked about it earlier. No pressure, but if you want to, I'll be here. Just gonna wait right here. Look at this lighting, oh wow.